That was Wayne for you guys. <laughs> Time to make a video, guys. Set up the camera here. All right, hey you. Yes, you. I'm talking to you. It's time to talk. It's time to talk about Powerwall. Today, I wanna talk about the top five questions that the DIY Powerwall video has generated. They keep popping up again and again and again, and I think I should answer them in video form. Question number one, are you going to use a BMS system? For the most part, this comes as a statement. You're not using a BMS system. You need to use a BMS system. And those are the nice ones. The real nasty ones are like, look at this idiot not using a BMS system. He's gonna burn his house down. The quick answer is, I don't know, but most probably not. Here's the reason. Uh, it's not that I don't believe in BMS systems. I, BMS systems work. My Tesla Model S has it. My Chevy Volt has a BMS system and it works when it's well designed. It does its job and it actually makes the battery safer. Uh, most of the production vehicles today use them. So when it's well designed, it, it works. I don't necessarily believe that exists in the open market for the DIY stuff. In the early days, the BMS systems were badly designed and most of the time were the cause of a battery actually burning up or causing, you know, damage. And so I believe that it's not always gonna be the, the case. I think with the in the e-bike industry, for example, that is a growing market and so many people are putting money and there's so many people working on making products for that. I, I believe they will eventually come up with a system that is cheap, affordable, and it's well designed and it's gonna be configurable to pretty much, you know. I don't believe we're there yet. And even if we are, if there is a system out there, I'm not aware of it because I'm not really messing around with e-bikes yet. Maybe in the future I will, but I don't. So the real question is why my interest of making this thing without a BMS? That is, I possibly a better question and the reason is because i believe that batteries don't require batteries are not as dangerous as everyone makes them out to be um there are a number of people that are using lithium batteries without a bms system now for years and they operate them in a safe manner um and so i i mean i don't come i didn't come up with this i just kind of learned from it and you know i that's how i built the samba the samba is now going on two years working without uh a bms system and so for those people that might say like oh well you you you're wrong because you believe that batteries can be safe just purely out of just that one car that you have which is the only one in the world that it's so far operating safely on a on a lithium battery just wait until it catches fire and then there's but that's not, the, the truth is, it's different. It's that there are other cars, you know, EV West is putting cars out every month that do not have BMSs and they go to customers that are necessarily, you know, savvy when it comes to batteries, they're not. So there is a way you can do it. Uh, and that's the things that I'm discussing in my videos. If you are one of those people that are, think you know better and then you know that because I don't agree with your views or whatever you've learned that I'm an idiot, then there's not much I can do for you. It's hard to teach someone that thinks they already know everything. For those of you who wanna learn something, stick with me. We are going to learn. We're gonna be doing a lot more um, experiments in the future, having to do with batteries and how to use them safely.
guys, thank you for watching my videos. If you like what I'm doing and you feel compelled to further support my channel, make sure and click in all the links that I have in this page. There's uh, links to my sponsors, there's links to my social media, uh, there's links to other videos that you might find interesting that are related to the one that you just watched. You guys make it all possible for me to do what I do, and I'll see you next time. Thank you, bye.